today, beside our olive tree, in our conversation about the way of praying that I love, Ignatian spirituality, we're going to spend a little time talking about the pra favourite prayer of the founder of the Jesuits, Saint Ignatius. Saint Ignatius was known to say that if you have time for only one prayer each day, then pray the examen. So what is an examen? The examen is a way of looking back over our day to see where God was with us. It is sometimes called the review of the day. One of the great insights of Ignatian spirituality is that God is found in all things, that everything that happens has God woven into it, that everything matters. And so Saint Ignatius would have us spend some time reflecting at the end of the day, or perhaps at the beginning of the following day, on what happened in our day, and in where we might notice God's presence. The examen is often described in five steps. The first step is to ask God to bless our time of prayer and to shed light on what it is God would have us notice. The second step is to let one's mind wander through the day that has been, almost like replaying a movie, noticing where we have been and what we have done, and taking particular notice of the things for which we are grateful. Even the most difficult day has some things for which we can express gratitude to God, perhaps that we are alive at all, or for a meal we have enjoyed, or for the sun shining through a tree covered with autumn leaves. The third step is to notice our feelings through the day, taking particular notice of the strongest feelings. Were we particularly happy at some point in the day? And what led to that happiness? Were we sad? What made us sad? Did we do something we regret? Were we angry? Did something happen that made us angry, something to us or someone else, or to a whole group of people? The fourth step is to reflect on those things we regret, those things for which we are sorry, and to ask God's forgiveness, and to spend a little time knowing God's forgiveness in whatever way God helps us to sense God's loving presence. The fifth and final step of the examen is to spend a little time thinking about the day ahead. What lies ahead for us? And where do we need God's help, God's company, God's guidance? Our examen closes as we ask God to be with us in the coming day. James Martin, who was with us last week by our olive tree, writes about the examen in a chapter of his book, which he has called Beautiful yesterdays. He says, the examine builds on the insight that it's easier to see God in retrospect than in the moment. With the examine you're less likely to overlook the slow work of God and finding God in our examine makes us more likely to look for him during the day. Next week beside our olive tree we will look at another way of Ignatian prayer, a way of praying with scripture. Through the week though, perhaps we might have a little go at the examen to see if we find ourselves seeing a little more of the slow work of God in our lives.